Hi, welcome to clickmyproject.com. This video will lead us to a cluster based routing protocol for wireless sensor networks with non uniform node distribution. In this process, we are going to design a cluster based routing protocol for wireless sensor network with non uniform node distribution. The exhaustion of intensity in nodes are extensively unstable in behalf of eccentric node dissemination. A cluster based routing protocol which contains energy aware clustering algorithm and cluster based routing algorithm is adduced for wireless sensor network with eccentric node dissemination. The EADC algorithm elevate homogeneous clusters based on the amplitude of contention. The cluster based routing algorithm stimulate the cluster head to designate surpassing exertion nodes and exiguous constitution node as their adjacent bounds to accumulate promotional province. It equivalence load among cluster head. Our protocol can balance the exertion of intensity among nodes and accumulate the network existence considerably. Now we are going to see the process flow. First we are creating a wireless sensor network containing 100 sensor nodes with non-uniform node distribution. After creating the network, we calculate the equivalent distance between each nodes in the network. Then we generate maximum independent sets by dividing the node equally. After creating the set, we calculate equivalent distance amongst nodes in each set. Then we deduct the node with minimum and maximum area in each set. Then we calculate the tra transition energy of all nodes for 100 rounds in each set. After calculating the transition energy, we calculate the remaining energy of all nodes for 100 rounds. Then we select the node with highest remaining energy after 100 rounds as new set head. Then we select 3 nodes in each set with maximum remaining energy. Finding the number of neighbors for selected nodes in each set. The node with highest neighbor will be selected as new set head. We repeat the above process until any of the nodes energy expired. Now we are going to see the demo of the whole process. First, to start the process, we must run network creation.java. By clicking the create button, we are creating a wireless sensor network with hundreds nodes and a sink. Then we are going to calculate the Euclidean distance between each nodes in the network. We can select any one of the nodes from the combo box and we can view the distance between the selected node and other nodes in the network. Then we are going to generate 10 independent sets by dividing the nodes equally such that each set must contain 10 nodes individually. Here we are generating the set and viewing the set by selecting a set number in the combo box. Here in set 3 the node id is considered as a set 3. Then we are going to calculate the distance between each nodes in each set. Here we can select any one of the set and view the distance of all the nodes in the selected set. Also we can deduct the minimum area node and maximum area node. Then we are going to calculate the transition energy of each nodes in each set. Here we can select any one of the set and we can view the transition energy of nodes in that set. Here we are experimented 100 rounds and we set initial energy as 5. The transition energy is calculated by distance and number of neighbors in that nodes. The remaining energy will be calculated by subtracting the transition energy from the initial energy for all the nodes. Then we are going to calculate the receiving energy of all set head in 10 sets. 
then we are going to view the receiving energy of all the set head in 100 rounds here also we are setting initial energy as 5 and receiving energy of all the set head is 0.18 then we calculate the aggregation of receiving energy aggregation cost and transmission cost for all the set head then we are going to deduct the new set head for deducting the new set head first we deduct the nodes with highest energy in each set then we are going to view the node in each set with highest remaining energy after 100 rounds then we are going to select top 3 nodes in all the 10 sets with maximum remaining energy after 100 rounds to select as new set head here we are by clicking the maximum energy nodes we are deducting the top three nodes in all the sets then we can view the top three nodes of all the 10 sets by clicking the view button then we deduct the number of neighbors for the selected nodes to deduct the number of neighbors we set the minimum distance as 200 which means the distance of the nodes below the threshold level is considered as neighbor node by clicking the deducting neighbor nodes we deduct the neighbors and we have to wait until the process completed then then we are going to view the new set head for all the sets based on the neighbor and remaining energy. We can repeat the above process for 200 rounds and we can view the nodes in that round. And we can select 300 and we can view the node with most remaining energy and maximum number of rebus after 300 rounds. Likewise, we can repeat for 400-500. The above process will be repeated until any one of the nodes in the network uh, remaining energy will become zero here by clicking the final round we can see the node with re remaining energy below zero in a thousand rounds thanks for watching us